All right, come here. Show us what you got, Ben. So there's a really interesting feature. Come over here. Come to the camera. Tell us what you got here. All right, so this MBM 4MB. Come closer to the camera. You got a 4MB uh, lower. Okay, who, make it talk louder. This is by uh, ADM. So this, you see, you've got the normal uh, full MB uh, selector, but then you also have full MB bolt catch and bolt release. Wait, oh, but, oh so this is built into the receiver? We so, yeah. Oh, so the receiver, the receiver itself is designed to take this. Mm -hmm. So that's not a mil spec re lower receiver then? No, it's not. But... Okay. No, that's fine. I just want to understand what we got there. I thought this was like an aftermarket because I've seen other ones no. that go around and under. So this is actually built into the receiver and designed to take it. Exactly. So yeah. you've got this system where you just push it up there. Yeah. There you go. Locks forward. And then you yeah. pull it down. Yeah. See, to it. Yeah. See, what I like about this is like normally, I think it's no, normally like when I'm locking the gun open, it's dumb. <laughs> dumb this way. So normally when I want to lock the gun open, um, as a, as, as a, if I'm shooting righty, I kind of put my thumb, it's kind of awkward, you know. You know, this can be a little, well, this one's really, I don't want to catch it, okay. So, so normally I have to do something like that, you know, to lock the gun open. Okay? Whereas, with this one here, come on the other side now. With this one over here, the thing I like it, is you pull it back and you push up and you hold it. Now, one of the things I'm noticing is, this thing is almost like really designed for you to use this because oh, yeah. when I was when I was using it from the other side, it was kind of slipping on me. Yeah. Okay. It wasn't like it, I think it was just catching it on the edge. Whereas yeah. with this, when I push up, yeah, it's not slipping at all. So this is this actually works better from this side. So that, that's just interesting because because sometimes there's, there's a cost benefit to using things. So if you if you opt for this. Uh, sometimes you might lose, you know, at least on this one, it, it seems that it doesn't catch as well. Let's try it again. If I go underneath it, pull it back. Maybe I, it. Well, maybe I wasn't pushing harder. Or maybe if I do it with my thumb. Now I'm not getting slippage. All right, whatever. But yeah, this seems to be a lot easier to work with. I, li I like this. Now, uh, again, who's the, who's the company that made this, uh, makes this receiver? American Defense Manufacturers, and honestly, their stuff is... Uh, very affordable compared to something like LMT. I mean, that's another good company, but I believe those lowers, a strip lower from LMT is like 800 bucks, something like that. Yeah. So when you bought this, what did you buy? You bought the, 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 the a, a complete yeah, lower? Just the uh, strip lower. For it was a strip lower, and then th this, the, the, the lever that was separate? No, it, was, it came attached. It came attached to it. So how much did that cost you? Like 300 So it was $300 for the lower receiver, mm -hmm. which included this, the... Um, the um, the the the, the, cat, the bolt catch lever. Yep. All right, cool, very nice, man. This it, I, I really like it because it kind of solved the problem that I've always found to be a pain in the ass. Oh yeah, that's the one. You know, where if I want to lock it open, I have to kind of like do one of these jobs. But the thing is, like, you do this like kind of at the beginning. You know, you don't yeah. like you're not constantly. So I just think, uh, let's have you shoot those rounds over there. All right. I got three mags in there. They got like two rounds each. Right. Yeah, let me get my earmuffs on. Get your earmuffs on. So let's watch the bolt hold open action. So lock it open. Just the rims, right? It's here. Ah, right. oh, we got the lefty magnifier on it. <laughs> All right, so locks open. Now that time it didn't lock open. Interesting. Okay. I think that was an ammo issue because we had the ammo. Because those are 45 grain bullets. Yeah. So we saw earlier that uh, it was a lock and open. So I, I think that's just because we're using the less, you know, the 45 grains, which have probably a little less pressure. Well, that's, that's very interesting. I've never seen that before. I'm glad you brought the to check out. Yeah.